Hi, welcome to the live broadcasting today. Okay, so by the way, hope you all everything stay good and everything is okay with fight for our pandemic. Okay, still stay at home, everyone. We keep motivation. We have some today. I'm so sick also. Okay, no, it's okay. No problem. By the way, my name is Alex, and today also to welcome our drums teachers. Okay, and uh, Ryan and Xiao Heng. Hello, Hi everyone. My name is Ryan. Okay. Hello, my name is Chang Xiao Heng. Just call me Chang. Okay, so today we are still continue our topic. Our topic is play games. Uh, so what does mean play games? Play games, drum. Huh? If you don't have a drum set at home, so play games. Using games? Is it um, suitable? So today we talk about it. Okay, so what is what today we are on the sharing? Um, either Ryan, you start first to share with all our students. Uh, I think playing drum. Okay, without a drum, there's an app you know online. There's a lot of app that you can find where on the phone you find it on the phone or app store. But other than that, uh, actually Google itself, the website, they have uh, a lot of these virtual drum sets. You know, they like a virtual kit or a virtual website that lets you to play all the drums. But how is it going to look like? Okay, now I have an example here. You know, very good example that I search. Okay, is something like this. Okay, now as you can see the screen, okay, this is a website, okay, it's Google, it's Google, sorry for doctors, okay, okay, this is Google, it is a website, okay, in this website, it's pretty easy, we can know that, okay, this is a drum, you can see, well, uh, as if anyone see, it may look like uh, just big, okay, but no, this is a drum, this is an actual virtual drum, as you see here, virtual drums, okay, how it goes is, yes, this. By pointing my mouse uh, or my cursor around the screen, okay, you can see I press the base, okay, it makes sound, okay, it makes sound, it makes the kick sound. Now, if I go to the snare, I press this, it will snare sound. So, same with all the other instruments we can see here, okay, example, you press, play all the symbols, flash, tap, right symbol. Else, okay, and drums also. Okay. Now it makes different sound, just like your, uh, your actual drum set, but it is in the website. Okay, it is in the website, and you are not actually having it, of course, but you are actually playing it with your cursor. But other than cursor, you can actually play it with your keyboard. Now, uh, I can show a bit the bass. That is my snare drum. That is my hi hat. Okay, what I can do is I can show you some basic uh, drum beats. Okay, on my screen uh, to let you know how it uh, actually goes. Okay, so I'm gonna play now. Okay, make sure you can see. Uh, I'll start with okay. I'll start with my hi hat. I'll go one, two, three, four.
Okay. Um. Here, yeah, there. Okay. I'm playing actually with my fingers on the keyboard. Okay. I just pressing all the keys. Okay. Without using the cursor. The cursor is still here. I'm actually using my keyboard. Press it. Play another drum solo. Okay. It's pretty easy on the keyboard. Uh. You just need to practice with your finger. Okay. Now this is a uh, actually a pretty good way to let you know. Like you never touched a drum before. You just want to get into it and. Make some beat, you know, just play around, okay? Make some beat, you know, in this, you know, you're at home, you got nothing to do, you don't have a drum set, okay, it's good to go to this website, you know, it's called Online Virtual Games Play Drum something, okay? Uh, you just go on it, you just play around, around the drum. You have a lot of, um, you know, mixing, custom, anything, okay? It's up to you, it's just for you to play around, okay? It's not an actual drum, it's not for you to practice, Okay, it's just for you to um, play around. You know, having a free time, maybe you're tired, you have stress, you can play around. I think you know, it's a good app. Okay, me. Uh, it's not that much I can show. So I think I'm gonna back to Alex to explain back, uh, how you want to. Okay. So okay, so quite cool. So this this is all the what we call that virtual drum. So we can do actually it's not like um, it's to present this is the drums, the actual drum set like is a we are trying to do something, play games like um so how to say that um, we can play either we know Okay, this is the bass drum, this is the snare drum, how the sound like, okay? So this is what we are talking about today. So that the, uh, okay, how, however, that's got a lot of the pattern of the drum, so you can play around the drum set. So of course that the website, they have a bunch of the lesson drum shoot uh, music drum score drum lesson drum game as well so it's very very suitable for beginner go to expos it's actually we want to tell you all it's expos more you expose more you get whether you're playing the virtual drums you're playing the apps drums so you just go and go for it right okay so and how about Xiao Heng? You anything you want to share today? Yeah, actually, uh, speaking of just now that website, the virtual drum, right? So, uh, for those people who don't have the laptop, you can also try using the virtual drum app using the Android phone. Oh, cool! To play it, for example, I have one right here. So when you press it, you also have the sound effect. Oops, sorry about that. Yeah, so if you prefer your phone instead, you can also use your phone to play this kind of drum. So this is just another thing that is more suitable for people that I prefer phone. Oh. So do, yeah, do you can yeah. can you share other other can you share other others like um present on the on the screen? <laughs> oh, I, I will have to need to download it again. But my Wi-Fi here is not good. Lah, so, mm. <laughs> hard it's, to download. It's okay. It's okay, no problem. Uh, I think I have something to share. Is okay. That, that, that app you're having there on the phone, I think, is, I think it's pretty good. You know, um, I started out there uh, before I, I think, I think before I played drums. You know, I, I actually download all those apps and try out, you know. You know, each app, they have different, um, how to say, build quality or maybe sound quality. You know, some apps, okay, it may be a little, uh, very small. Again, the app capacity or the cap storage may be a little small. And you download it, the sound quality may just be in a little not good or maybe poor. Okay, the sound is just like, uh, it's not accurate. Okay, not to say like 100% accurate, but... 
not accurate at all. Okay, that drum, uh, that kind of app, that kind of drum app, uh, we can just put it aside. But that app you're having there is actually quite good because I've tried it before. Uh, I think I use it for, I think I use it for practice. Uh, it's not like uh, uh, with stick that I practice, but I learn the X small parts from online, somewhere else. I just test it out before I get into uh, the real drum. You know, I just try with my finger, I get the feeling or get the sound so I, so that I know how, how it goes. You know, it's just like a preview, preview of how you're going to practice the specific uh, part. It's like I have a bar, four count bit. Um, they have different fills or different bits. So that I use the app and I practice it on the finger. So I get to know the sound. And eventually when I get on to the drum, when I take on the Ah, I know because I heard the sound before. I know how it goes. So when I get on the drum, ah, I got the image because I got it on my phone because I've tried it out on my phone before. So when I get on the drum, I can straight away, ah, I know how it goes. So I think it's, uh, it's a pretty good you know, alternative for you to learn practice other than uh, go to YouTube, download those composer apps, type in each note by note, and you play it out again. So it's good to have the drum app and you try it out on your finger. I think it can let you have the image, lah, you know, uh, sound image, or anything else, or the, or the finger things, or, the, or your hand, or which drum you're going to hit. I think it's pretty good. Yeah, it might not be that good compared to the, of course, the real drum kit, but at least you'll get the overall idea of the how it sounds like and how the posi positioning of the drum. Uh. Okay, so it's quite good. So no problem. So is it? Is it? It's very simple. So now we, without drum, you so okay, can do during this FMCO, you can do a bunch of things with a game, with an app, with a virtual drum. Okay. So another thing, okay, and want to share this one to you all. So, so of course you can play like that. Oh no. Just a moment. Okay, I think on the screen I already have uh, some like um, they have some lesson plan. You can just like point of the playing method, so they're automatic. So you will see on the screen on the there. So you can choose a bunch of the exercise, then you can play the virtual drums automatic just on the play button. So like this, I'm um, just share the funky, funky jazz funk. So we got six, nine type of the jazz funk. So the second. Can share share a lot different different. So how about we just put back to Ryan to present? Okay, oh, okay. Because sometimes I present, I'm using my my PC to present, so everyone here can't see it very clear except you uh, look back on the live streaming site. Well, other than present, I have. I'll just. Fair few apps. Oh, know. okay. Um, yeah, I'll come back to this. Okay, it's a website. It's good. Well, other than that, uh, actually we can search. Okay, okay. There are some drum apps that I search on Google, as you can see. Um. Okay. Maybe I'll just put Android. Yeah, uh, one good thing is okay. Maybe I'll just use this link. Okay. I believe just now the one is this one because I've used it before. 
in the real drum. Um, I think I'm gonna present it. You know, what are the actual app that is really good? Oh, you know, rather than uh, anything else. Um, the app is this one, the one that Xiaohong Tang Show. Oh, uh, is this one? It's pretty good. It's pretty good. It's decent. I can say it's decent. So it's a drum kit. But other than drum kit, uh, we have you know drum pad. The drum pad, the electric drum pad. Again, that most of the DJ use. The DJ, uh, you can use to mix up things and you know, as I said here, great variety of music style, hip hop, drum, bass, trap, dubstep, house. Okay, dubstep is the main one. Okay, because it's using more concert DJ concert uh concert mix up all the music or uh, maybe like all those pop music that you requires all those uh drum pad. Okay, so this is a quite good drum pad. There are a lot okay down here it's still a lot. Okay, a lot of this uh drum pad app it actually okay, it's not a drum. It's not a drum, it's basically just a pad. Um how about I show you is okay I'll show you another one. <laughs> okay. Uh, drum pad. Yeah, this is actually the um, actual image of the drum pad itself. Well, this is the app image, of course. Well, this is the actual thing. Okay, you might see it very colorful. Uh, colorful. All the things you can press along on the pad, where they sell the remix. Okay, it's all this. Okay, it's a drum pad. Okay, it doesn't have the image of the drum, but you can insert a lot of uh, drum voices, uh, but drum voices, drum clips, or the voice clips that they can put inside. And then it will sound the thing like a drum, but instead, again, instead of using fing uh, uh hand uh your sticks, you use fingers. But yes, uh, you can see it. Uh, actually, use uh, yeah, you use the you use the sticks. Okay, you can use it. This is the, all those the hitting type of sticks. But other than that, is the sing uh the finger type. Okay, the finger type where you can use only your finger and press it, and it makes the drum sound. So back to the app is. Is this kind of app where if there's this one, the drum kit on, I don't think it's that, but it will be the actual drum kit like uh, the previous one that Chang showed, which is this, the real drum. It will have the actual drum and press on it. It only has the drum sound. When we go along, okay, you can see Garage Man. Okay, this is the another great app to let you to play drums, but other than drum, you can actually make a band. You can make a small band out of it, actually, it's pretty good. You can have guitar, you can have uh, drums, you can have uh, a lot of other instruments you can play on it. Okay, it's a garage band, I think it's for iPhone or Android. Yeah. Okay, you actually make a small band and it's a compose app. Okay, you have a compose app and an instrument app, like a drum set app just now is used to play only the drum set. Now, this band, again, okay, this is much band thing, okay, this app. It actually makes the compose a small band, okay, other than drum, guitar, okay, a little piano, or something else. A lot more you can do with all these apps. Okay, well, uh, this one, I think a lot of people played before is the Music Tiles. I think the Music Tiles app uh, is not actually uh, music, but it's more towards rhythm. Beat that you get again okay, just when key uh, when the keys flow down from the top you just press. Uh, I think it's good for the fingers, but if you want to learn the actual, uh, I think no. Okay, it's pretty fun play. I think these two apps. Okay, it's not the actual. I would say learning lah. Okay, learning app lah. It's just a uh, playing app. Okay, but it's okay fair. It's just to learn uh rhythm and something else. And we have more. So we have more varieties. Like I said before, uh, it's about quality, quality wise. So you, know, you download each app. It depends on what quality you get. Uh, some go inside and you sound a little bit not good, and some are very good, you know, very decent, and some are not. So there's a lot of apps, like a lot, like a lot. Okay. Other than other than drum, I would like to tell this one is your metronome app. Okay, it's pretty useful on the metronome app. You know, uh, you don't need to like buy the actual metronome itself anymore. You can just use the metronome app. Yeah, it's pretty good using. Okay, very decent for home practicing. Okay, as well as uh, 
you don't need to uh what uh make noise lah and then angry your neighbors or something else. You just plug it into your phone, just download it, put the earphone, then you can listen. Eh, while you just practice, okay? Because the metronome just goes into your ear, and then it's pretty good. So there's a lot more app. I think I'm not gonna go very detail on it, but it's a lot as you can see. As I said, it's about quality, right? Yeah. So it's pretty okay. Good. Yeah. So what yeah. is your most recommend? Most recommend apps. What, what is my most recommend? I think I think it's back there. Okay, yeah. it's this one. Okay, real drum. I think this is the the most or decent app. Yeah. Of in 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 Android, you know, in Android, this is the most decent app. So, so guys, remember download this. Uh, yeah, uh, it's pretty decent. Like really, really uh, decent. Yeah, the yeah. show show, show that. Now, a lot more. Uh, uh, yeah, you got a lot of uh customization, or you can add sound. You can lesson. Uh, lesson is I think it's lesson not to say. Um, uh, you can play on the app. You listen. You know, you play drum. You listen first. Then you are able to play. Okay, you don't need to actually look at score and uh interpret it what uh note by note again. You just hear it. You can just play by hearing. So I think this app is is a plus lah. It's a plus for it having uh free lessons or free sound tracks like just now uh, what uh, Alex uh, gave out. You know all those small lessons. Okay, it's not long. It's not long. Just the beats. You know the beats sound. But then when you listen it, ah, uh, you know next time. Oh, I have this kind of um alternative i can play this kind i can play this kind i have different genres okay i get rock i got jazz i got latin i got samba you know i can have different kind of genre on the drums so it's for you to know only like okay if i said real uh will you need to go on you need to practice i don't know it's for you to have the you know sound image like i said sound image okay to let you know uh, what is to play okay uh okay i'm not gonna go into detail anymore okay i think i'll pass back to okay cool thanks thanks for your sharing so anything else uh Xiao, Xiao you want to talk about you want to share something Um, yeah, so yeah, I agree with uh, what Ryan Kong say. Uh, if you don't have uh, an instrument or whatever, you can just download this kind of app and just play around with it. Uh. As long as you're having fun with it, uh, you should be able to get, get the hang of it. Uh. Even though it's not like the real kit or the real instrument, at least you'll get some of the ideas of the instruments that you want to play. So yeah. Okay, so almost we today we're sharing about this that uh virtual drum drum apps play games uh, almost almost here so and then next week we plan we have to decide to plan to give it a small lesson and through uh the virtual drum then you can learn using air drumming you can using the that drum pad or table or stool or pillow so we're just doing whatever you are learning i think it's cool right <laughs> yeah i think we're good yeah so we're gonna show okay that how the virtual drum so after that how you need to do how you need to practice so we will we'll show you like almost like Okay, virtual drums and then drum notes is almost like that. So after that, we how how we do, how we practice on this beat. Uh, I think this is quite cool, and free as well. So others we want to keep um, and hey. Uh, I think our add on lah. Our add on is uh the next. Uh, our, you know, our show here at around two p.m. I think we will talk about, like uh, Alex said, we will tell you uh, how you can practice uh, pad, uh, pillow, or anywhere else. 
uh, about the setup. You know, it's about how you're going to practice. You know, a lot of people, when they go home, they don't know how to practice. You know, this is true. This is true. It's definitely uh, not simply made up. Okay, it's actually true. When people go home, that's it. Practice. But how? Uh, maybe like, like uh, when you go for lesson, you know, go for lessons in a studio or classroom, they may have all the facility they have. You know, they have drums, they have metronomes, they have good... Uh, they have good soundproof auto system ready for you, but once you get home, uh, you have different setup. You get at home, you doesn't have drum, you doesn't have metronome, okay, you doesn't have uh, maybe you doesn't have drum pad or doesn't have the place to even practice. So, uh, it's a good uh video session that we're gonna tell you how you can set up properly and how you can practice. So I think it's a uh, pretty good. Uh, sharing session for that. Yeah, then we hope to see you next week. And don't forget, if you have any comment, you can comment down below and let us know. Then we can answer your question so we can do it more better and better, right? So anything yeah, else actually. for Xiao Heng? Um, yeah, actually, just now, uh, my friend, he wants to ask question, but he can't comment in your comment section. All right. No, good, good, good. Then we answer here. Oh, so, so he just uh, messaged me the question instead. Uh. All right, right. Cool. Okay. I, I'll just read it out. So he asked, nice. By the way, speaking of games, is the Taiko game able to improve your drumming skills? Then what do you think? I for me I haven't I only know that game but I personally I haven't played before so I don't have much experience on that game. The Taiko Taiko I think I played before the PS3 I think not mistaken. PS3, so actually it's good for the rhythm. Yeah yeah, hmm. true. It's not about that you can't compare the Taiko drum and the the acoustic. Uh, so called acoustic drum, jazz drum kit. That's the difference. But the one thing is the same is rhythm. So, how about you? What do you think? I, I think so, it's, yeah. Like you said, uh, it's rhythm. It's rhythm wise. No? Yeah. Drum actually is about rhythm. Yeah. Uh, like you said, drum is actually about rhythm. So, uh, I think it's a good app to. Play rhythm lah, only for rhythm lah. Yeah, and it's like playing wise, okay, for playing, for actual learning, yes, you can learn a bit, you know, but too on the rhythm, you get the feeling from yeah, it's quite good. Yeah. So like me, like just um for very simple, I just like simple show that I can clap. We also create the rhythm. So the same thing, the same thing. That's the taiko drums, you're playing on taiko drum, you have to follow the, the point, then when you want to hit, when the music goes, then the same thing with the clap the hand, the same one. That's the same thing, although you're playing guitars or although playing a piano, you also need this rhythm. So this is the very good question. So thanks, Xiao Heng's friend. You can comment down below. Let me check what's going on later on when we check it out. Okay, so anything Xiao Heng want to want to keep um, comment? Mm, for me, I think that's it. No comment. Okay, good. So I think this time is almost up. Time's up here. And then thanks for watching our video and thanks to our friends, comment. So although you can't comment down below, it's okay. It's, it's okay. Thanks. Anyway, thanks to all to support us. So hopefully next week we can take more aggressive thing to present, to show everyone the music level, drum level. Okay. So hopefully see you next Saturday and 2 p.m. So don't forget to follow us every Saturday 2 p.m. and stay safe, still stay safe at home.
So we are every everyone's still the same, okay? <laughs>